Phew! Be tense. All right, let's go back to the other house there. This is basically my forward house right now. That's the one I actually prefer. Help over here! Thanks. Oh shit! I blocked the, the thing. <laughs> I, I just came out on top. Gordon is always on top. Admiring the car, buddy. Oh wow! I have like no shotgun ammo. <laughs> Sorry, Doc. Another Strider from the Water Tower! Yeah, check out this one. He's... he's on a fucking mission. I'm out of here, bye. You drive backwards. Oh, they don't really go as fast. Like that was the last one. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Get ready, everyone. We've spotted drop ships carrying even more strikers. We have about a minute before they hit. So gear up. This is gonna get us some people in over. Yeah, and this is the final part. There we go. Ah, uh, those flea shots! I swear to God. Alright. It's gonna get ugly. Like your mother! Okay. It's a shame they take out the Magnus generators here. I guess that's what makes it, makes it difficult. I guess we'll stay in the valley here. So it's been easy up to now. We have a strider coming in from the crate! <laughs> I'm really not going to use this at any other point. Fucking love this part. <laughs> I would I would just play this over and over again. And let's go. Go up. Do it would end with lots of striders? Uh, why didn't you jump before? You spoiled it. Alright. I guess we'll go behind this guy. Shit. You know, he's relatively close, so let me go and... Damn it. Let's see my long-range sniping abilities. Damn it. Not too, not that good. Alright. Uh, we got one coming in this way. Well, let's do this. Alright, well, let's go get the one that's over here. This guy should be relatively easy to get. I was worried that that missed. Yeah, there's like way too many of them. I think you'd have to do this on easy to save all the buildings. I can't really see another way. Because I've tried. Lord, I've tried. Magically re repairing stuff. There right, we go. But this is like by far the funnest part of the, the game here. Oh crap. Uh oh, 
The car is literally the best attack I have for against hunters. That in the air at three, of course. Oh fuck, seriously. Oh yeah, motherfucker, what now? You get the fuck out of my house. Oh uh, yeah, I'm probably not gonna be able to take this with me. That one I sniped him. No wait, another attack. The Striders have been defeated! All personnel return to base immediately! Oh. Repeat! All personnel return to base immediately! Oh, that was awesome. That was that was so much fun. Hey! Gordon Freeman! Wow. Thanks, Freeman! Good going! Magnuson devices! Wow, Gordon! You were amazing out there. Come on. <laughs> oh man. As I said, one of my one of my favorite parts. Although it, I don't know. It, it's yeah. It's just great. No, I, I don't. I hate final bosses, final but stages. this is great. The portal's close to open, but Doctor Magnuson sure will be in time to stop it. It's always my favorite game. Support equipment powered down. Hold on a moment, Kleiner. Ah, Freeman. Well, I see the Magnuson device performed flawlessly. I feel compelled to thank you personally for saving my rocket. So, um, thank you. <clears throat> well, that's enough chit chat. I've got a rocket to launch. Have fun. Wow. For a minute there, I thought you were going to get a hug. Let's go to the control room. We can get a great view of the launch from there. Well, here we are again. Oh, yes, the elevator from Half-Life 2. While you were out having fun, I found an old helicopter that I was able to get working. I've got it all packed up and ready to go. Yeah. Never a dull moment, huh? Never. Not to shotgun in the face. Approximately eight and a half pounds. Well, that's what they're talking about. Certainly not worth scuttling. Go back. At last. Ah, oh, Gordon. Hell of a job you did out there, son. Uh, let's not forget that with the Magnuson device, those Striders practically destroy themselves. <laughs> yes. Well, I think perhaps Gordon had something to do with their success. I suggest we adjourn this meeting of the Mutual Admiration Society until after we have launched our rocket. I believe we're ready to start the auto sequence. I believe Gordon should have the honor. You'll hear no objection from me. It's all yours, Gordon. Yeah. Silo door is open. Stations, everyone. Yeah, this is always awesome. Power to main thrusters. There's a timer. Steady on. E minus ten. Nine. We are launching. Eight. Seven. Six. Steady. Five. Steady. Three. Two. Still too early to celebrate. We need to reach altitude and transmit the signal. Too right. The clock is ticking. We couldn't have cut it any closer if that was our intention. It is going to work, right? 
It has to. Once the rocket is in range of the portal, we'll be able to switch on the Xenium resonator. Well, let's get outside. I'd like a better view of the fireworks. There should be quite a show. Regrettably, I can't come out with you. Magnuson and I will need to keep a close eye on the rocket's trajectory. Aren't you going to see us off? Just as soon as this is wrapped up, I wouldn't dream of letting you go without a proper goodbye. Okay, I'll hold you to that. You too, Dr. Magnuson. Indeed. We'll catch up with you in a moment, sweetheart. Gordon, hold up. Oh, there you are. The more I think about that warning from our friend, the more I'm convinced it has to do with Borealis. Don't be deceived. That ship must never be used. You have got to destroy it, whatever the cost. Where are you two? You're gonna miss it. Be right there, Alex. Gordon, thanks for everything you've done for Alex, for all of us. I couldn't be prouder if you were my own son. Now when you get back, we've got a lot to talk about. <laughs> Come on! Oh, it's winking. Eli, Gordon, Alex, Dear look God, at the portal! This has to work. We've activated the resonator. This is it. Oh. My goodness. Yes. 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 We did it. Oh, my we did it, oh, my Gordon. Gordon. We sure as hell oh, did. And not a moment too soon. <laughs> I'll bet the Combine aren't too happy right now. You got that right, sweetheart. But we've got plenty to celebrate. He was like, I'm a genius. I didn't have to head off so soon. If only it weren't so critical. It's okay, Dad. We'll find Judith and bring her back. Dog? Hey, where are you? What a nut. Don't go too far. Mm hmm. I don't really have any secondary fires. We. Whoops! <laughs> How did I die there? <laughs> what fucking really? Uh. All right, we're back. I finished fucking up, and I'd have no more ammo, so I can't even do it if I, even if I wanted to. Well, there she is, gassed up and ready to go. Remember to keep in constant contact. We have no idea what to expect. Don't worry, Dad. We'll be all right. I just wish all this didn't have to fall on you, Alex. Your mother would be so proud. Dad. Come on, Gordon. The chopper's waiting for us. Are you sure you have everything you need? I think so. Dr. Kleiner gave us the Borealis coordinates. We'll keep the hailing frequency open on the chopper radio in case Judith tries to reach us again. Good idea. She could well make another attempt. Oh no. Dad! Gordon! Help! Ah! Dad! Alex! Dad! Oh. Get away!
And that would be the end of Half-Life 2 Episode 2. So, um, so next up is going to be Half-Life 2 Episode 3. Oh wait, that game hasn't come out yet. It's been four years. I think five as of... I think it's about four years as of now. Yeah, so we haven't seen another Half-Life game for four years. Which is ridiculous. Um, been a very, very long time. Kind of stupid, but, you know, they left it off on a cliffhanger like this, and, uh... Yep. Uh... <laughs> that's it. Uh, nothing else much to say. Um, one of my favorite games, as I said, gameplay-wise, it's phenomenal. Absolutely great. Ex it, it's exactly what you'd expect from a Half-Life game. So, um... Yeah, they left it off on a cliffhanger. I guess, kind of, Half-Life 2 ended off on a cliffhanger, too. Um... Episode 1, if I recall, not so much. Well, yeah, I actually did. They all they all ended on cliffhangers. Valve really likes cliffhangers. But yeah, it's... But you know, it's... it's um, This is really good story, really good gameplay. It's, uh... Everything. It's one of the best single player uh, shooters you can you can possibly ask for. But yeah, so that was that was it for episode 2, and I guess I'm done Half-Life 2. Uh, I'll probably go revisit Half-Life 1 a little later, but for now uh, I'm all Half-Lifed out, and uh, I guess I'll, I'll give it a rest for now, but next time... Uh, well, actually, you know, Skyrim's coming next, so... <laughs> so stay tuned for that. See you later.